Hello everyone, I'm the Master of Rothness and welcome to Battlefleet Gothic Armada. Today we'll be looking at the Retribution Battleship, the last ship for the Imperial Navy uh, as of this multiplayer beta. So, currently the ship has access to 6 plasma macro batteries, 3 lance turrets, and 1 prow super heavy torpedo launcher. So this ship is all around a much better close quarters combat uh, vessel than that of his bro, who is more of a jack of all trades with the ordnance launch bay and Less turrets, but more uh, lance turrets. I mean, less uh, batteries, but more uh, lance turrets. Now, um, macro batteries are really, really good in close quarters combat because as you um, kind of uh, fire at enemies from long range, the accuracy actually goes down. However, I got the upgrade, which allows me to take away that penalty, which is good. So these ships, oh, well, not these ships, but this ship in particular will be very good for... Uh, long range combat as well as close range combat so I'm, I'm liking this guy a lot skills wise he has the supercharged void shield the uh, disruption bomb the plasma bomb and the taunt taunt will allow me to get up close and personal and fire down with some uh, macro cannons maybe do some damage with the torpedo launcher lining up the shots uh, disruption bomb will allow me to take out the shields and plasma bomb will allow me to do some damage supercharged void shields are for uh, I guess um I guess if I want to like engage an enemy ship and I want to conserve my shields, I can definitely uh, pop that. And that's kind of about it, actually. We also have our Inquisition ship, our Imperial Navy ship, our Adeptus Mechanicus ship, and our Space Marine ship. You know, I keep thinking about this, but seeing as though they're adding in a Space Marine fleet, I wonder how that will be different to that of the Imperial Navy, because currently you can get Adeptus Astartes... Uh, from this favor for the Imperial Navy, this uh, this favor right over here. So, I wonder how the Space Marines will function. Maybe the favors will be different Space Marine chapters, and they'll do a different thing. Like one will focus on Terminators, one will focus on uh, boarding parties, one will, will focus on maybe some different type of boarding uh, situation thingy. I'm not sure. I mean, I know the Imperial Fists have some sort of dark age of technology ship the phalanx i think is is what it's called but i'm not sure actually maybe some neck beard will tell me in any case let's go ahead and get this baby on the road pretty excited to show her off actually Alrighty, sorry about that my recording software just turned off in any case I'll pick myself a battleship and then afterwards the imperial navy ship the adeptus mechanicus and the space marine I'm not going to go with the Inquisition ship because it has a uh, torpedo launcher and I want Nova Cannons. I don't want two ships with torpedo launchers because the uh, battleship already has the torpedo launcher and I think that's a little bit of a hindrance. This isn't also a very good torpedo launcher. This is a, uh, let me check this out. Can I check it? Uh, it's a, just a prow heavy torpedo, that's it. So not really that useful. I don't know why I had to actually... I didn't have to this this uh, deselect these uh, ships. Actually, I can just like highlight over and read down there. I'm not sure why I did that. Maybe I'm going a little bit retarded. In any case, yeah, I just want Nova cannons, and these guys are, you know, they have Nova cannons, but they don't have any special perks to them. They don't have any favors. All right, so I think this is pretty good. Let's go ahead and send out our fleet into battle. Ooh, he's an eagle. Look at that shit. That's dope. Alright, so there we go. Let's get right into it. The reason why I like Cruiser Clash and uh, Space Station Assault is because there's no time limit on those missions. Whereas for Convoy and the other missions, there's a time limit. And I really don't like that. Alright, so let's move forward. He's just lining up his ships. This is an Imperium versus Imperium matchup, so that's going to be an issue. Orders. Now, I'm going to try and use Tactical Cogitators as less as possible, or as little as possible. Not less yes, as possible, god damn it, that's, I failed English a long time ago. In any case, I'm going to use it as little as possible. This is mostly because a lot of people do complain that I do use it a lot, but the reason why I do that is because I'm versing off against the AI. Obviously, if I'm versing off against the human player, I would never use Tactical Cogitators. That's mostly because, well... It's kind of bad manners, like, it's really lame that 
Tactical Cogitators is actually... Ah, oh God, he's going to see me. It's really lame that Tactical Cogitators is in this game actually for multiplayer. I think... I always thought that it was only for AI battles, and that's it, because... You know, you can't grief the AI. I spam Tactical Cogitators like this over and over again, but it's not going to piss off the AI. He's not going to call my mom a whore and say that he banged her after, like, Sunday's brunch or something like that. Actually, there was an AI that... Microsoft developed that in 24 hours became a Hitler-loving sex robot, so I don't really know about that nonsense. In any case, yeah, if I just spam tactical cogitators in AI battles, I don't really mind because, you know, it's an AI, but if it was like versing players, no, that'd be bad manners. Alright, let's go ahead and fire these because, might as well, Imperial Navy torpedoes are a little bit lame because it is just Imperial Navy. Instead of like the orcs where they have a Teleporting shit. Oh, wow. That is incredible. Alright, that's stasis bomb, but that's okay. Let's go ahead and turn around this guy. Shit, that didn't work out. Alright, while this happens, we're gonna go ahead and take ourselves out here. Come on. Ah, shit. That guy taunted me, that's not good for business. Let's go ahead and maybe get out this and then... Disruption bomb on you, my friend. Alright, so what else are we gonna do? Um, a taunt. Yeah, a taunt. Lock on target. Right now, we'll win in these engagements because we're just so badass right now. Taste my torpedoes, you bitch. Oh, wait. I'm the Imperium. I can turn. I'm so used to playing as the orcs, honestly. Oh, that uh, that was pretty dirty, actually. That should have probably been on the NSFW attack for Pornhub. And I just took out the shield, so that's not good. Who has the Nova Cannon? You have the Nova Cannon, and that's it. It's only one ship with the Nova Cannon, so... Yikes, actually. We need to take that guy out pronto, Arena. Let's go ahead and target the weapons, and then maybe we can do, like, a lightning strike or something. Wow, I was successful. Did I take out the Nova Cannon? I don't think so. I think that would be, like, too easy. That'd be, like, wow, too convenient, friend, Arena. Let's back out this guy. Activating tactical cogitators. Ooh, nice. Take out the deck. Good shit. Good shit. Nice shit. Oh, and I fired my I fired my load too early. Uh, get it? I fired my load. I made a porn joke. Alright. That way. Wow, we took out his battleship just like that. Holy guacamole, Batman. We're gonna shrek their competition, actually. As long as I keep this battle cruiser away from my glorious ships I should be fine and this guy is no he's not dead he's not dead okay, let's go ahead and do that how are we doing I'm doing fine Wow, we've really kicked the Imperium's butt. And this is hard AI, actually. I can't believe this has worked out so well. Let's do a plasma bomb. Let's do that. Let's do that. Let's spam it all. Spam it all. Yeah, hit my ship. Hit it. He had shields, thank god. If he didn't have shields, he'd be fucked or runied. See, I miss playing as the orcs. Already. I just love the way they play. Yeah, you're gone. Why am I even trying to stop you? Now I've just wasted that fucking ability for no reason. I suppose I could just Nova Cannon and get rid of you. Yep, good, good Areno. God bless. 10 out of 10 game. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Let's get some more DZs, I suppose.
I like how I said I wasn't going to use tactical cogitators a lot and I still used it. It's useful versus the AI, you know? That's all. I don't like to use auto cast on my abilities too much because sometimes my guys go full retard and they waste their boarding parties on like random targets. It's whatever though. People can complain uh, in the comments, I suppose. In any case, that will be um, it for our Imperial uh, Navy videos. Like showcasing off different ships and stuff. We'll probably go into um, multiplayer battles soon. Uh, once I'm done with the orcs, and that's about it. I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.